Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, guys? Your guy Crypto Chuck back here with the group Crypto Black. We're back at it again, baby. Let me know, guys, what do you think, think about this video here? Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. I like this news here. As being a person that was in the music industry, know how it is. Um, I think this is good news here as well. I think it's a great idea. So let's get right into it says most music listeners will pay for music with crypto to help artists survey revealed that 65 percent of e-music customers will use cryptocurrency to allow artists to receive a larger music revenue split a survey conducted by pioneering digital music store e-music revealed that most of their services users were open to paying with crypto if it allowed artists to earn more the survey shared exclusively with Cointelegraph revealed that 65% of e-music customers will use cryptocurrency if it was for the aforementioned reasons. It is worth noting that a mere 8% of the respondents that use Bitcoin or any other crypto in the past. Per the announcement, 800 e-music users answer questions about cryptocurrencies and their use in the music industry. Survey data revealed that 40% of the music listeners overestimate the amount of royalties that artists receive when their music is purchased or streamed. 87% believe that a fair share for the artists would be a higher sum with the most popular response being a 50-50 split, which we all know that doesn't happen. The report released in May by the International Federation of the Phonograph, Phonographic Industry showed the, that music streaming boosted music revenues to over $20 billion in 2019. Still analysis by the music news website, Soundcharts estimate that artists are paid only 0.00318 cents per stream on Spotify. Now using crypto to make royalties fair. As Cointelegraph reported at the end of May, eMusic is building a decentralized music distribution system to reduce the cost of inefficiencies and pay artists more when fans purchase and stream their music. eMusic, which launched in 1998, is known for being one of the first websites to sell DRM-free MP3 music recordings. Company data website Owler reveals that the firm employs 278 people and has an annual revenue of $65.7 million. The idea of making music fair using cryptocurrencies is not new. Independent tech marketing and PR consultant Eric Doyle told Cointelegraph last year that there are, in fact, many projects trying to apply blockchain technology to the music industry. So guys, uh, what do you guys think about this? Um, my thoughts on this as being a person that used to be in the music industry, this is, I think this is great news. I think you should utilize, I mean, you, it's, you Artists, it takes so much for artists to create, right? And they create a lot of good stuff, a lot of good music. It takes a lot to make a song, you know? And a great song that you guys hear every single day, and a lot of great songs you guys will never hear in your life. I've sat inside studios and recorded songs with artists that never seen a day of light, and it was some of the best music I ever heard in my life. So, um, and to only see that these executives that don't know the difference between a uh, acoustic guitar and electric guitar, they make most of the money from it. So I don't think it's fair. I think I will always be on the artist side. I will always be on the creative side, being a creative person myself, um, and being a writer and engineer. Uh, so I will always be on their side. I'm always a, I'm on the creative side. So what do you guys think about this? I think it'd be much easier. You can just send the crypto right over to the artist. They can get, uh, get more, get paid more money for their creativity. You know, so it takes a lot of skill and a lot of talent to produce this music that you guys hear every single day. So make sure you guys like and share and subscribe to the channel. Guys, I would love to hear what you think about this here. This is a very great, interesting story for me as I, like I said, I used to be in the music industry. So let me know what you like about this. Uh, drop the comments below. Until next time, guys, stack sets.
and chill, baby. We're out of here. Crypto Chuck here with Crypto Black.